Hello everyone, I'm Becky with Casas Por Cristo. I'm here in Juarez, Mexico at the property of the Mendoza family. Rosa is a single mom helping out her daughter and then her two kids. And we just want to say thank you so much for blessing this family, showing them God's love. And we're excited to introduce them to you. Let's go meet them. the Mendoza family. This is Rosa, she's 67 years old and she takes care of the grandkids. Her daughter Karen is 20 and she is working today. And then the grandkids are Alejandro who's 10 and Genesis who's three. And she's, Karen is a single mom while uh, Rosa is raising her grandkids here. She rents in a different part of the city, but she wants her, her house to be on this property. So I was born in Villa Dama, Chihuahua, mm -hmm. another city in the state of Chihuahua. But I've lived a long time here in the city of Juarez ever since my grandkids here were much younger. And I attend the church of Pastor Leticia. My daughter, Karen, uh, works in a market and sells things, but she's also taking college classes right now for business administration. So spiritually, this house will really impact us. And I want to say thank you so much for this great big blessing that you're giving us. It's going to be a great blessing from God. I receive a pension um, being retired, but also rent is so expensive. It's been really expensive to try to pay rent for my daughter for them to live there. Um, so that's why we're asking for this house. And thank you again for this blessing. Something interesting, let's see. Uh, my name is Pastor Leticia Cuevas and I am the pastor of John 316, Juan 3 Church. And something interesting about our church is that Jesus Christ is present in our church, amen, and uh, we are serving him there. Bueno, primeramente, vea, porque pues la señora Rosa. So I first chose Rosa because she is not yet a believer in the gospel, but since we've started this process, of asking for a house. She's been attending our church. She's been hearing the word of God. And I've already seen changes in her life because God changes hearts. Um, so I first chose her because of, of that need, but also physically they have a need of a house because they've been renting and moving from place to place, uh, paying expensive rent. And I hope that she would have a better quality of life in this way and that her daughter and her grandkids also would be able to have that. And everybody needs a stable place to live and a secure and safe place to live. So I would hope that this blessing would, would do this also for this family. Bueno, pues espero yo vea que el resultado sea que, pues que ya mire. So I hope that because of this house being built for Rosa, she would see the love and grace and mercy of God, that she would also move on, press on, persevere and walking in the way of God, um, because without him, we're nothing, and he gives us our purpose. 